Reclaiming Australia. What are you reclaiming? What? It's not yours to reclaim in the first place. And it's both of you. In Melbourne yesterday, there was a pathetic 50, 100, 150 races, far lower than what took place last time round. I'd also say today, we have a much bigger demonstration against them today, and they are much smaller. I'm going to give a taste of what I found on your Facebook page, and then you tell me who are the racists, who is violent, who is scum. Waste of money, I could do the job for the price of a 9mm bullet. This is from the Reclaim Australia Perth Facebook page. And you're telling me, we can fight violence. I was hoping the next terrorist attack in Australia had happened by now. Obviously carried out by another lone wolf Islamic follower, but this time killing a lot more Australians. This is from the Reclaim Australia Perth page. I just want to let everyone to know uh, that in West Papua struggles, there is no room for racism. Yeah. We, are, we, are, we are up against the system, but not the Muslims. It makes absolute, complete and utter sense for this union and unionists in general to be here today. Um, because we're challenging a group that wants to rip our community apart that wants to create and stir up fear, hostility, resentment and division. We understand the MUA very, very much of the attacks on the racist attacks that's been whipped up by the Abbott government is directed also against the union movement as well. Mate, it's no mistake that when the unions are under attack, the Royal Commissions that have been held in the 70 odd million dollars, plus the millions and millions of dollars that have been used by the Labour government to try and malign the union movement, to try and make workers here in Australia subject to the most draconian conditions and lose their jobs, that they have to whip up a racist sentiment here in Australia as well. The workers united will never be defeated! The workers united! Say it loud, say it clear, racism not welcome here. Say it loud, say it clear.